March 30 and 31st, 1978, the first election after the victory of the Islamic Revolution in which more than 98% of Iranians voted for the Islamic Republic. This was just the beginning. December 2nd and 3rd, 1979, Iran's new constitution was put to the vote. Then it was January 25th, 1980, the first presidential election in Iran after the Islamic Revolution. Since then, people have gone to the ballots to elect a president nine times, and on Friday, June 14th, 2013, they cast their votes in the 11th presidential race. Even Iran's leader is elected through indirect vote of the people. They elect members of assembly experts who choose Iran's leader. In addition, people hit the ballots to elect members of the parliament directly through ballots. The ninth and last parliamentary election was held on March 2012. People talked to Press TV about the importance of voting. I vote to influence changes that are going to take place in the country. I want to have control over decisions that are made in this country. I'm voting to elect a president who works for the people. I don't want a president who just talks and does not act. Experts also share the same view. For three obvious reasons, Iranians have been voting for the past 34 years or so. The first reason is about self-belief and self-determination. The second one is about belief in democracy. And the third one is about belief in God. I can say in just in a wrap-up way that uh, they do vote because they know that their votes count and they have a say in the future of their countries. So there is no reason for them not to show up to vote and, and it has been the case for the past 34 years. Members of the city and rural councils are also directly elected by the people. The council's election is the biggest in Iran in terms of the number of candidates and seats. The fourth city and rural council elections will be held concurrent with the presidential election on June 14th. Since the victory of Islamic Revolution more than 34 years ago, Iran has held an election almost every year that, according to experts, is a clear sign of democracy in the country. Arash Khalatari, Press TV, Tehran.